Welcome everyone. Are you ready to worship today? Tell me, who is amazing? Jesus is amazing, yes. And why is Jesus amazing? Because there is no one greater. So let's get on our feet and sing out with everything we've got. Here we go. Jesus is the very best. There is no one bigger or stronger or greater. Jesus is amazing. Who is amazing? Jesus is amazing, that's right. Well, our Bible verse tells us that everyone who heard him was amazed. Luke 2:47. good job. I can tell you've been practicing your memory verse. Let's do it again. Everyone who heard him was amazed. Luke 2.47, good job. Jesus is so amazing and I am glad to know that he wants to be our friend forever. So let's sing one more song to him today. Are you ready? 
about what God has done It's amazing, so exciting It's big enough for all who want to come Yeah, everybody join a happy song Because God loved us so much He sent us His Son, we're singing that he sent his son Jesus and he is amazing. Who's amazing? Jesus is amazing, yes he does. Well, why don't we get to our true story from the Bible about someone who has the most amazing out of this world power. Who do you think it is? Let's go find out. Who, who, know what time it is? It's time to hear a story full of Here. Oh, hi, I'm Lucy. Look what my friends and I have been doing. We have decorated the clubhouse to look like outer space. We're playing Out of This World. Outer space is so amazing. Did you know that a rocket ship is the only way to get into space? I'm building a toy rocket ship and I'm almost done. I just have to put on the last piece. There. So cool. Now, my rocket ship is ready to fly into space. Count down with me. Five, four, three, two, one. Blast off. <sighs> wow, a rocket is so amazing. It's just about the most powerful thing there is. Who? Who? It's Ollie. Hello, Lucy. Who? Who? Flying a rocket, are you? Hi, Ollie. Yes, I am. My rocket is so powerful. A rocket has power. Yes, it's true. But someone has greater power. Who? Who? Listen to this story. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. Hola friends, I'm Luis the Handyman, just out here on this beautiful day using power tools. <laughs> I love that with the press of a button, I can... Ooh, have all the power! <laughs> but today's story is about the one who has the most amazing 
out of this world power. Do you know who it is? Do you want to help me build this story? Great. Let's put it on the story fence. Hammers up, little builders. Ready? Uno, dos, tres, hammer. Great job, little helpers. You can put your hammers down. Now we just need our story tools. Yep, we have everything we need. Okay, so like I said, today's true story from the Bible is about someone who has the most amazing out of this world power. Hmm, now I wonder what kind of power we have. Like, do you think we could stop the sun from shining in the sky? Huh, let's try. Everyone yell, stop sun, stop. Ready? Stop, son, stop! Did we stop it? No. <laughs> well, we don't have the power to stop the sun. Hmm. Do you think we have the power to make it rain? Huh. Let's try. Everybody's gonna make it rain on the count of three. Ready? One, two, three, rain! Okay, stop! Look! Is it raining? Uh, no. <laughs> Do we have the power to make it rain? No, we don't have the power. But there is someone amazing who does. Do you know who it is? Yep, it's Jesus. <laughs> One night, Jesus and his friends were on a boat out on the sea, and Jesus went to take a nap. All of a sudden, a huge storm came up. Ooh, ooh, can you make it sound like a storm? Now, rub your hands together like this. Ah, do you hear the rain? Oh, and then it started to rain harder. Now, pat your legs, everyone. And harder, pat faster. And harder. And Jesus' friends were scared. Now, show me your scared face. <gasps> it was raining and thundering and lightning. <sighs> and the boat was rocking back and forth. Ooh, can you rock back and forth with me? Oh, whoa. Ooh. So Jesus' friends woke him up. Help, Jesus, help, they said. And guess what? Jesus stood up in the boat and he looked at the wind and at the waves and he told them to stop. And the storm stopped. Jesus had the power to stop a storm. His friends were like, wow. Can you say that with me? Wow. Yes, they were amazed because Jesus, God's son, is out of this world amazing! Hey there, Ollie. Tell me, who is amazing? Jesus is amazing. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who is amazing? Jesus is amazing. <laughs> That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. Adios. See you next time. So there's your story, and it's all true. Jesus is so powerful, he stopped a storm. Who? Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Who? Who? Wow, Jesus is so powerful. He told a big, huge storm to stop, and it did. Jesus is amazing. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say got it. Get it? Got it! Good! Rockets are so powerful, but Jesus is even more powerful. He is amazing. Hey, Rocket, let's go launch to find my Bible so I can read more about Jesus. Five, four, three, two, one, 
Blast off! Jesus had the power to stop a storm. His friends probably thought, wow. Can you say wow? Wow. Yes, that is so amazing. And Jesus has the most amazing out of this world power because he is God's son and he can do things that nobody else can do. Who is amazing? Jesus is amazing. You're right. So why don't we pray and thank God for sending his amazing son to be our friend forever. Dear God, thank you for loving us so much that you gave us your only son, Jesus, to be our friend forever. Thank you for sending him. Thank you for loving us. Help us to always remember that you're with us. In Jesus' name, amen. Great job, everybody. I'm so glad to be with you today. Keep working on your Bible verse. I will see you next week. Bye.